It's Garen Cohn. Welcome to the second annual Celebrate Female Veterans Day at the Nami Nami Room here at Brevard Zoo, sponsored by AVET Project and a slew of our supporters. Close to 16 female speakers, each bringing something very valuable to the rest of us that just want to hear and learn from what they have experienced, both in the military and post-military. Clark. I'm a U.S. Navy veteran and a real estate agent here in Brevard County. I want to say thank you to all of the veterans and all those who are currently serving and continue to serve us. This community is so amazing. The Space Coast is amazing. Brevard County is amazing. And just remember every day is a new day. Get up and strive to be the best that you can be and just be awesome. Give back to your community, ready to help somebody, always ready to volunteer. Hi, I'm Tara Johnson. I'm a special events coordinator at the Brevard Zoo. And one thing I would tell my younger self is follow your passions and don't go for a job just for the money. I'm Cody Bogart. I'm the CEO of KB Solutions and the author of Hilo Girls. If I could go back to tell a younger self me one thing, it would be even in the hard times, you will get through it. If you think you can do it, you can do it. Just take that one step forward in the direction you want to go and you'll make it. Hi, my name is Courtney Butler. I am currently with Get Fit With Court. I teach yoga. I'm also into uh, personal training. Some advice that I would give myself or when I was younger is always listen to your gut. Your gut always knows what to do. And I certainly wish I would have done that when I was a lot younger. Hello, my name is Millicent. I work for Career Source Brevard. I'm a 22 year uh, veteran, uh, retired veteran from the Army. Um, at the Career Source Brevard, I am a disabled veterans outreach program consultant. Um, we help with resumes, we help with uh, job searches, uh, we also help with career advisement. Um, the other areas of, that we help with is at giving them other options of finding education. If I were to go back in time and talk to myself as a 22-year vet, I would tell myself to always maintain your determination. Determination will get you through the good times, the bad times. Um, never let someone haze you out of a situation or tell you that you cannot overcome. Overcoming is what our veterans are doing, even those that are Vietnam veterans, those who have not had the education opportunities, and those that are now in need of service. We are strong and we work together.